Logan Williams' cause of death has officially been confirmed by the coroner's office to be an accidental drug overdose. The 16-year-old Flash actor died from accidental unintentional illicit drug toxicity, fentanyl, according to Canada's BC Coroner Service report. Toxicological analysis detected fentanyl in a range where lethal outcomes have been reported. Even small amounts of fentanyl have been shown to be potentially toxic, the report, which was dated May 10, read. Williams, who is best known for playing a young Barry Allen on the CW's The Flash, suddenly died on April 2, 2020, just days ahead of his 17th birthday on April 9. Last year, Williams' mom Marlies Williams revealed that toxicology results showed her son died of a fentanyl overdose following a three-year battle with opioid addiction. She now hopes Williams' story will help raise awareness of addiction and prevent another mother from experiencing her pain. His death is not going to be in vain, Marlies told New York Post in an exclusive interview, published in May 2020. He's going to help a lot of people down the road. Marlene said although her family kept Williams' addiction under wraps due to the judgment, embarrassment and criticism, they did all they could to help him. She said she remortgaged her home to send Williams to an expensive treatment facility in the United States and another in British Columbia in summer 2019. I did everything humanly possible, everything a mother could do, she told the Post. I did everything but handcuff him to me to try to keep him safe. Marlee said she last saw her son four days before his death, when they enjoyed a home-cooked meal together, he said to me, Mom, I'm gonna get clean. I'm going to get better. And I want my new life to start. Williams was in eight episodes of the CW superhero show, with his last appearance coming in the season 2 premiere in 2015, according to IMDb. He also had roles on Supernatural, The Whispers and When Calls the Heart, Contributing, Sydney Henderson, 